We really lucked out there. Fewer injuries than I would have expected, and most were minor. I suppose the only conclusion we can draw is that they really were after Elfric all this time. Perhaps they were instructed to avoid unnecessary casualties. Is that Elfric guy really a cardinal? Are the secret cardinals really a thing? I thought that was a myth. Hard to believe. Did you folks in the Ashen Wolves know that? No, that's news to me. The identity of the cardinals is top secret. Even within the... He never would have told us something like that. Oh, except maybe Yuri. He and I talk about a lot of things. But right now, I'd say we have more important topics to discuss than his title. Alfred's been kidnapped. What are we going to do about it? Even if it is in the name of rescuing him, we simply cannot hand over the chalice to those scoundrels. Let's just give them the thing and be done with it. Professor, I came as fast as I could when I heard the report. I had no idea you'd be here. Hello! Is this loud... Uh, excitable knight, a friend of yours? Uh, he's a friend of my father's. Precisely so. I'm Alois, right-hand man to the former captain of the Knights of Seros, Geralt. Oh my, that means our professor here is the child of a captain. Now, about Elfric's kidnapping. Since he's an important member of the church, we must use any means necessary to find him. That said, most of the Holy Knights have been deployed to deal with the Western Church. Sure, but any knights are better than no knights, yeah? I like your attitude, though I'm still embarrassed that we're not in full force. But hey, at least we're quite forceful. <laughs> Boo! <sighs> Here, take this letter. We believe it was left by whoever kidnapped the Cardinal. In it, the enemy clearly spells out their plan. They're after a chalice that was hidden beneath abyss. A chalice? Hmm? Chalice? Hmm. Ah! Do you mean THE chalice? But no, why would it be there? I've never heard anything about it being stowed away in abyss. Then this is gonna come as a shock, pal. What in the goddess's name? Is that really the chalice from the legends? The probability of that is unassailably high, yes. It was guarded by a bunch of giant creepy toys. There was powerful magic protecting it and everything. I saw it with my own eyes. They're big you eyes. say so. Wow. That means the story about the chalice being bound was true. Well, what's done is done. Oh, but I guess it's not done just yet. I must report this to Lady Rhea at once. Let's keep going. Jump, jump. Cindered shadows, betrayal. I wonder if there's a, I wonder if there's a traitor within the group. I, I wonder, I wonder. So that is what transpired. This is indeed the chalice of beginnings. It matches the descriptions and the few records of it that remain. Don't beat around the bush. What's our punishment? You removed a most sacred treasure. Truly, it is my obligation to mete out punishment for that transgression. However, you also helped the church locate a valuable artifact. In light of this good deed, I shall forgive the bad one. I do wonder... What's on your mind? I am wondering whether your presence had anything to do with the artifacts unbinding, Professor. As per the Church Chronicles, the four apostles secured the chalice with powerful magic. The only way to release the chalice is by using the four crests passed down through their bloodlines. However, given the special power you possess, perhaps you were able to unlock it yourself. 
There is no knowing at present. For the time being, I will keep the chalice somewhere safe. As for Elfric, I assure you that the knights will find and return him in due time. I consider him to be one of my many children, after all. I will not allow harm to befall him. Lady Rhea, might I ask a moment of your time? We cannot be expected to give up our endeavor. The enemy stated most clearly that if the knights are involved, our dear Elfric is finished. We owe him so much. If there is any possibility that his life is in danger, the risk is too great to chance. True. The knights are strong and all, but they're liable to get him killed. We can take care of it, with Chatterbox's help. Our professor has the strength of a hundred knights, or about one and a half of me. We've got this. How about it, Rhea? We've been through too damned much to get here. Leave the Chalice and Elfric to us, and won't regret it. Lady Rhea, please. Hmm. I'll take full responsibility when they die. If you join your power with theirs, yes, perhaps there is hope. As you wish, I shall entrust you with the Chalice. Your Grace, the Chalice is a legendary treasure. You can't just hand it over to those underground... That is quite enough. There is no cause to worry, I assure you. There will be no further discussion on the matter. Even if we lost hold of the Chalice, it would be impossible for the thieves to make use of it. Though it was created to return a life that was lost, I doubt that anyone alive knows how to accomplish that feat. If someone were to successfully replicate the ritual, it would perhaps be the work of fate. Okay. <laughs> hey boss. I had the most blank face ever. How'd like, you end up right. down here in Abyss? What is this? Some sort of interrogation? Yeah, you've never been big on sharing. I mean, you know all about me, and there's still so much I don't know about you. Look, I get it. Talking about the past isn't easy. But I'm curious, yeah? So get to it. I've got all day. Do you now? <laughs> well, I guess now's as good a time as any to tell you. I'm here because I killed some people from the church. That cannot be! Hmm, you have a grudge against the church? Of course I don't. What kind of person do you think I am? Someone who'd willingly kill others? Originally, I attended the academy as Count Rose's adopted kid. There came a point when the church ordered me to wipe out some members from my old gang. They told me I was part of some important mission. Who is this old gang you speak of? They were nothing more than common thieves to someone like you, Constance. Anyway, they're like family to me. So naturally, I protested my orders. Things got pretty heated, and, well, the rest is history. That's some story, pal. You're damn lucky they didn't execute you. <laughs> You're telling me. Alfred stepped in and implored them to spare my life. I told them to consider the circumstances. It's not so different for the rest of you. I'm sure he helped all of us out in different ways. He did. I was about to be thrown in the monastery's underground jail. People thought I was dangerous, what with my gift and all. It's dark and dingy here, but it sure beats a prison cell. Elfie really saved my neck. Back to the point. Balthus, what was it you were so curious about? You had ideas regarding why our enemies may be clawing after the chalice, perhaps? No, nothing like that. But I am hung up on something Rhea said. That binding on the chalice was linked to the four apostles, yeah? I know I've got Chevalier's... Sorry, but mind if I cut in? What is it? Can't you see we're busy? I can, but I just remembered something. Something important. Specifically, the names of the Apostles. Oban, Chevalier, Noah, and Timotheus. 
the four apostles whose bloodlines were lost to time. I figured the Ashen Wolves might have thoughts about all that. Uh... No use hiding it now, Constance. Let's lay all of our cards on the table. As for me, I've got the major crest of Chevalier. When I enrolled at the Academy, the Church ordered me to keep that tidbit to myself. So I did. Mm-hmm. And I've got the major crest of Oban. Never did sort out how it is I have this thing. As for me, the blood of Saint Noah courses through my veins. This is kept hidden, even from the Empire. Which probably means mine's from Timotheus. I do have a vague recollection of being told my crest is rare. So the four crests, which were presumed lost, have all been gathered into the same house. All thanks to our buddy Elfric, it would seem. And now Elfric has been abducted. Why could that be? If it was the chalice they were after, they could have stolen it from us without the need for anything sly. Maybe someone had it out for him. Or maybe he messed around with the wrong people. Or it could just be unrelated entirely. We're trying to untangle this mess by tying more knots into it. I mean, Balthus, you landed here on accident, didn't you? It's not like that's linked to the rest of us. And I could just as easily have never ended up down here, you know? You're jumping at shadows. Anyway, we don't have time for this. Let's get our act together and head to the chapel ruins. Can I hop my way there? Yeah, I can. Here we go. We're doing it. Yeah. Ho. 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 <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I don't know what I'm doing. Hop. Yeah. Jump. Yeah. Jump. Yeah. This is called KZ knows he's not going to come back and cut out this load. Are you fucking kidding me? This game really... What was the fucking point of going back to the hub to end the chapter if you put me in the hub here anyway? This whole time I thought we were we we're jumping into the next fight. Let's go. Fucking I'm antsy. Let's do this. Hey friend. What's up? What do you want? Let's not deny that there's a connection between us. How about you and me have ourselves a little date, huh? Mm. Uh you're smiling with your mouth but not your eyes. <laughs> it only happens when I'm being a little greedy. When the bell strikes midnight, meet me out front at the Holy Mausoleum. My only condition is that you arrive promptly after midnight, and not a moment before. Uh, why such a late hour? It's the most romantic time of the evening, of course. Or is the idea of a date with me not appealing to you? <laughs> Nobles have nearly killed one another fighting for my affections, you know. Perhaps you won't get all you want out of me. <laughs> but I'll promise you a fun time regardless. It's settled. I'll see you tomorrow night, friend. Don't stand me up. Your Grace, please reconsider. The chalice is among the church's greatest treasures, akin to even the hero's relics. I am well aware, which is why I have already dealt with the matter. Consider this. The hero's relics are fearsome weapons imbued with great power. On the contrary, the chalice has long lost the power it once possessed. It is little more than a token of history. If that is so, then why is it still considered such an important artifact? It was created for a sacred purpose. To use the blood of the four apostles to Return the goddess to our world. Their blood. Your grace, is something the matter? I have an urgent mission for you. Investigate the origins of the Ashen Wolves. Start with their enrollment forms for the Academy. Keep an eye out for falsified documents. Yes, of course. Understood. Before you begin, summon Alaris at once. I have new orders for the Knights as well. As you wish, Your Grace. If I am correct, we haven't a moment to lose. Another tragedy is soon to transpire. Alright, here's KZ's beautiful, that crumbly old chapel absolutely important long-shot prediction of the plot of this DLC. 
which is that uh Aelfric's a bad guy. He brought all four of these together because they have the crests of the of the four like apostles. And he wanted to get the cup, and then he wanted to put their bl all their blood in the cup so he could use the power to revive people. <laughs> uh, and he wants to revive uh my mother because it relates to me. And he talked about her in such a way that he almost feels like he wanted her instead. That's my long shot prediction. Probably wrong. <laughs> I think the first half's right though. We can play little part here, save perhaps as a bargaining chip for our dear Elfric. Getting yourself captured instead? That wouldn't be good at all, Constance. I think we should be more worried about B's appearance. I mean, he's got way, way more uh, life experience than the rest of us. And all that life experience makes you look more like a knight than a student bee. You saying I'm old, pal? Don't forget, you're speaking to the ageless king of grappling. She's not wrong, Balti. There's a pretty big age gap between you two. Yeah, you look really big. You're friends with Helda's older brother, right? That explains your maturity. You make Hubert look like a spring chicken. Huh. Can it, will ya? Anyway, I'm wearing a school uniform. No way in hell they'll think I'm a knight. Yeah, and anyone wearing a school uniform is without a doubt a student. To be honest, for a good while, I actually did think you might be a knight. Who made your uniforms and set up the Ashen Wolf House, anyhow? If I might so humbly interject, that would be Elfric. He pulled everything together for us, sometime after he was appointed as the Guardian of Abyss. Said he wanted to give former students who were expelled from the Academy somewhere to live. Somewhere to belong. Of course, all of this was established long before any of us were in the picture. So getting you four together was a coincidence? Perhaps. After hearing all of that, it's not as unbelievable as I thought. All I know is that he helped me, so I'll help him. I strongly doubt that I shall factor into Elfric's retrieval, but I shall follow your lead. There it is. We owe Elfric. Maybe your goddess doesn't care about debts, but my fists and I sure do. Sorry to have roped you into all this, friend. And if it's for my students. What a pal. The Ashen Wolves really landed an A-plus professor. Not just on paper, but in practice, too. This is great! Has me ready to get to it and start hitting things. Yo, what's up? Ever since I was a kid, I've lived my life by one rule that I'd only play my hand if I was guaranteed victory. I've gotten this far by using my cunning in any way necessary. Lying, cheating, even killing when there was no other way. But this next play? Well, the odds don't exactly seem to be in my favor. Not unless you trust me enough to provide me with an ace. <laughs> Never you mind, friend. Let's just go. You see, he knows that there will be four times the amount of enemies you expect on this map. And, and he's like, the, the odds are stacked against us. Which they are. Oh, man. <laughs> this guy? Yes, you've arrived. You certainly took your sweet time. My flock, why have you come? Save you, of course. You didn't really think we just up and abandon you, did you? If I may be so bold, we have the chalice you seek. Might I humbly request that you return, Elfric? You found the chalice? When I told you of it, I never imagined you'd... Let's make sure it's not some cheap imitation. Hand it over. Not until you hand over the hostage. There needs to be some degree of a trusting exchange here. I can see you don't understand your own predicament. We've no issue killing the lot of you and taking it either way. I 
can't tell if this guy's ears are stuffed with wool or if he's just this stupid. Can't say I'm surprised. Thugs like this aren't about to show us any gesture of sincerity. Yuri, stand down. Believe me. Take the chalice and flee. You must. It is irreplaceable. You must not hand it to these brigands. <laughs> you know us better than that. We didn't come here without a plan. Do your thing, Happy. Wait, do what thing? Seriously? Right now? Uh... Now, Happy! Fine, fine, fine! <sighs> Versailles! She... Oh, no. <laughs> I've gotta say, that sigh of hers never gets old. Yeah, yeah, glad you like the show. It's not like it's a gift I asked for. Uh, where did that thing come from? <laughs> Absolute cowards. How entertaining. Balthus, will you do the honors? Leave it to me, boss. I got damn! <laughs> hey, Balthus, quit scoring around. Oh. Wow. I flew off of him. I'll sort it out. At least we got Alfred back in one piece. How to handle these fools. Cheap party tricks. Let's make these children scream. I did my scream. There you go. I'm so low energy in these moments where I'm like, all right, I'm ready. I'm ready to go. Let's do it. Let me punch him. Let me punch him now. Uh, we've been stuck on this uh, low bar for a while. There we go. <sighs> well, let's see. Route the enemy. Aelfric can't die. Okay. Let's have a look at him. Is he a unit? No. No, he's not. Okay, that's... Is Balthus just gone? No. No, he's okay. Let's look at the map. Yeah, that's... Wait, hold on. Oh my god. <laughs> he did get flown off. Definitely need to take him out. He has a brave sword that's fucked up. That's the double hitting sword. I don't really have any preferences on who is where. This is a dense fucking map. All right, uh, let's get going. Your reckless actions could have been the death of you. Still, I thank you for saving me. Don't go thanking me yet. We've still got to get out of here. <laughs> There's no time for foolish blunders when our future is at stake. We must complete the mission the noble gave us. We shall vanquish these infidels post-haste. Didn't mind brawling a giant bird, but now I'm stuck here. Oh well, time to show what happens when the awe-inspiring king of grappling goes all out. Oh, you idiot. Well, let's get, let's get started. Sure thing. You should nail this guy. There we go. We have an armor slayer. Adorable. Nice. Well, also, his ring lets him move after attacking. Sometimes, not now though. Only occasionally. I will prevail. That's going to be pretty useful. Through. God, so many dudes. We, yeah, we need to do this just to split their attention. Otherwise, it's a. Otherwise, we're doomed. Yeah, wait there. Ready and willing. There, that's what I like to see. This theme in particular, I think, is really good. I like this one a lot. It's one of the newer songs, but I like it. Uh, let's shoot him in the face. God, there's so many heavy armored dudes. 
I don't I don't like it. And I'll wait I'll wait for them to get close to me. How about that? Battle. Yeah, make sure that you're topped off. The sun. There, you can now use bolting. Damage one of them. Then move backward. Stay focused. Yeah, not a lot of movement's gonna happen this turn. In fact, end now. Very good. Another step forward. Next. Oh, that comes out. Good. Wow. That's our Dimitri. That guy didn't do any damage, but he crippled me. God, this entire squad. Oh! Oh! I forgot to attack with Balthus. Okay. Hold on here. Gambit. There we go. We can we can get some with this. Much better. Let's move this way. Now, you can't do too much, but you can do a standard attack. Yeah, please restore him. Yeah, he's going to be dead otherwise. Well, we'll have to figure some stuff out with you. But we don't have to worry about your health if we kill everyone who's around you. Let's just go ahead and uh, roll that back. Me? What was your chance of hitting? Zero on both of them. But this will help. Oh, here we go. Bimble better comes up just a little short. Are you fucking kidding me with all of these misses? Stay focused. Whose ass I gotta eat to get to get this to work? Oh, you're you're gonna you're gonna piss me off. The sun. Move here. Stay focused. How about you try it? Do the ruptured heaven hit? Okay, I'll take it. All right, no one's gonna target him. These guys are targeting me, which ain't great, but you know we'll take it. I will prepare. I'll give it my all. I can't do much against their armor. Yep. Yuck. Yuck. Hey, even if it's chip damage, we should try. Yeah, Steel Bow can get something. Ready and willing. Alright, move back here. Meanwhile, Let me at him. 
You don't have to kill this bird. Focus on shit that matters, in fact. I didn't want her to die, but you know, fucking, I didn't want to roll back time again. It's a finite resource. Oh, he's so fucked. Oh my. Fuck it, I don't want to look at it anymore. We will adapt. This is going to be a messy fight. Those cats are calling for backup. <sighs> when will this end? Hmm. Hmm. No, no, I should, I should, I should roll this shit back. As much as I would like to just start off, you know, continue rushing toward this guy, losing people like that wasn't great. So let's do what we can to to get a good get a good ending here. Why doesn't it choose the one that's up there? The, the, the way they divvy up the enemies to, to hit here is very obtuse and weird. It's like I'm hitting up and it should just be whatever I'm aiming at. Whatever, we got it still, but you know. All right, take him out, uh, move to about here. Stay focused. I guess you're still gonna be the closer for this spot. The 50-50, let's see a good one. Yes, very good. Oh yeah, there's this whole problem. I'm at my limit. I think you just drop a concoction here. Sure thing. Anyone else here I know that can heal? I don't think so. I know Yuri can, but I'm going to have him do, do a big battalion thing. Actually, hold on. Experiment. Experiment thingy. One, I'll heal him here. Then run back a little bit. Does anyone have a battalion gambit thing that would do, do a decent amount? Ready and willing. Is there a way to... Is there a way to view that even? Hmm... I don't think like there's one where I see a list of every single person's moves yep. in terms of like what their battalions can do, but we'll we'll experiment until we find something uh find something solid. I will prevail. You know what? You probably have one. Edelgard that can do good. There. Keep things under control, please. And if they can't move, I can just, uh... Keep them limited here. Who, me? Uh, now... You can't reach any of the other enemies, so... Go in on this side. Give it my all. Alright, this middle area has been mostly taken care of. Fuck it, kill the bird. And then we'll get the next one on the next turn. Who else needs to move? Ah, it would be, it would be you. Oh, you have a healing item. Boom, pop that. All right, done. Predictable. You're out. 
You are out. No, you're not. <laughs> Moving from there, no one's dead. Better ending established. He's not going to be able to move, but we'll just uh, rip him to pieces. Good job, Balthus. You got it handled. All right, that's it for him. All right, we should start pushing forward. So we'll bring people to the right. Honestly, I'm pretty I'm pretty confident in in Violet. So yeah, just just stand there and do what you can. As for you, lads. Yeah, I did buy this armor slayer. Kind of, kind of wish it could, it could get a kill, but you know, you know, you know, you can't get, you can't get everything. And from here, I guess Happy can do something. Nice, nice. So we got the we got a command com commanding thief leader set up over here. He's gonna start moving down. I think we'll like group up around this bottom right side. Things are looking solid. Meanwhile, this team uh, needs to be careful. Not so fast. KZ, you looked and saw it would kill you, me? and you still fucking did it. You you still looked and said, "Push." This seems like a good idea. Oh my fucking Christ. Am I really blowing two, two, two of these on just her? Okay. People that aren't her do shit. Use caution. There, that'll give him a, a little bit of cover. Oh my Christ. These misses are driving me up a wall. Like, I can't even count on these motherfuckers for anything. Hilda, retreat. I don't want you dying. The last thing I need. Uh, uh... Yeah, I think we're out of gas. Yeah, he already did his turn. Who, who's who's missing in terms of... Oh, you can do stuff. Dope. His costume looked really dark, so it did. It looked like he was done. God... Enough, I don't need to see anymore. I don't need to see anymore. Oh god, reinforcements. Be mindful. Put him in the ground. Let's see. There. There's still so many of them. Happy? You know what to do. Again? What do you take me for, a Psy servant? <sighs> That's just gonna make this shit messy. Why are monsters like that in Derek Mock? Oh, well. Perhaps I can take the treasure they found as a parting gift. All right. Now that we've uh, lowered their morale. God, oh! I could have been. 
All right, do that. Shoot the one directly in front. People just getting levels like it's nothing. Oh god, you made his escape over here more complicated. Not a fan. Yeah, you take it out. Edelgard moves in further. Yep. Uh, wait. Yeah, this is our western team. Worry not. Bolting will smite that one. I do not want you getting shot. Holy shit, the range. There we go. I guess that's your best shot. Sure thing. There, heal that whole point. Next. Sorry, there's not there's nowhere I could move you where you weren't going to get shot. There, no more sentries. Assault troop. I wish I could teleport him into a spot where he'd be useful. Uh, but no such, no such luck. Hmm. Oh, yeah, I can target him, but that's not, it's not super ideal. All right, all right, fine. While you're busy dealing with us uh, over there, we're doing this little pincer attack maneuver, which I'm a big fan of. You're getting body blocked, but we're just going to have you avoid the monster. Ah, yes, you're up here in the air. An attempt was made. Is that all? All right, your plans have basically failed at this point. I'm taking I'm taking this motherfucker on the top left under siege. I'm at my limit. Let's see, what can we do to get a kill on you? Nothing really. Just a few more moves. Then all will know that I am the Empire's <laughs> Forget I said anything. Then again, if you die, it won't matter either way. <laughs> I'm getting strong. Yeah, see, he's got some interesting empire nonsense going on. Let's see if you have unique dialogue. Ah, oh, you can't move anymore. Darn. Wait. Hold on. Restore. Thing. I want I want to see if we got some unique dialogue stuff going on. Let's see if we can get it to work. I will prevail. 
can it be? Princess Eight of God. Huh. How dare you disrespect House Gressfell? This ends here. How the fuck? My man's dodged Ready it. I guess the whole fucking three houses are gonna have to put this dude down. How can you not reach? It's fucking three spaces away. You bastards. Never been more disappointed in these motherfuckers than I ha than I am right now. You sure? Get out! Ugh. Baby steps, I guess. I don't mind pain, but it's time to make my exit. My employer pays me more than this treasure is worth. Well, it looks like we still have enemies to rout. Though there is a chest I do want to pick up on. I'm guessing we just have to get rid of the rest of uh, rest of his assistants. I hope they don't want me to get the monsters too. At that point, why waste my time? End the turn. Let's mash start to get through this. As expected, Byla killed the thing over here. Of course I'd go down. Okay, that's fine. We can lose you. You did the good thing early. Yeah. Who's left? Ah, oh, there's you, of course. Who in terms of red team is even left at this point? Don't tell me no one. Ah, fuck. You're really gonna make me fight the monsters. What a waste of fucking time, game. It's like, fucking move on. Let's, let's just move on. There's literally... There's no... There's whatever. You gotta get the value, I guess. <laughs> They're like, this DLC was $25. We gotta... We gotta, we gotta put in that value. Uh... Alright, let's... Let's get into it. Okay, do a little bit of that. I think I could just have you... Yeah, I can have you, like, deal some damage here. You critted. Okay, maybe I'll complain a little less, because the game clearly wants to be nice to me. It is showing me some kind deeds. Let's, uh... That's not even a fucking word, but let's... Let's smash them! Yeah... Oh, we can fly up here. Nice. Uh, stay where you are. Good job, Linhart. As I expected. Oh, that was seven turns. Not too bad. Okay, Elfric. I am. All thanks to you. The chalice. Is it unharmed? Yes, it's safe. Chatterboxes. What? Nighty night! Oh no! Things! Dramatic things! D show me the things! Yuri! You damn scoundrel! What are you doing? <laughs> I think you can see what I'm doing, Balthus. Beautifully executed, Yuri. The chalice is finally mine now. 
along with the blood of the four apostles. Jesus fucking Christ, I really did call that shit. It seems I was correct that there was an enemy in our midst. To think our bird was instead a rat. You've always had a wild imagination, Constance. <laughs> I've got to say, turning your attention elsewhere was a challenge, even for me. That is enough for the banter, Yuri. I informed you not to divulge too much. They'll all be under the dirt soon enough. It's not like they'll be able to talk at that point. After all I've gone and done for you, Alfric, I would think you'd have just a bit more faith in me. Your silence speaks volumes. <sighs> Guess this is the end of the niceties. It's all on you now, friend. I'm sure you and the others will figure it out. Professor! Are you injured? It's nothing too concerning. I see you're well enough to make light of a serious situation. But surely you suffered a wound. No. Teach, there's no time for playing around. Tell us how... Ah, I get it. He only pretended to attack you, didn't he? So you were just playing a part in this grand performance. But was that really the smartest decision here? The Chalice and the Ashen Wolves are gone. I am loath to think what will become of them without our help. And how do you propose we pursue them? Well, we know what they're after. That at least narrows down the possibilities. <sighs> Professor, are we too late? Lady Rhea, why have you come? After sending all of you off, I began to investigate the lineage of the Ashen Wolves. In doing so, I was able to confirm that the documented information about their crests was falsified. What was once a wild speculation, I now know to be true. The crests they bear are the same as those of the Four Apostles. The very same who long ago enacted the Rite of Rising. Once the blood of the Four is poured upon the Chalice, its power can be harnessed. I believe we have enough evidence to assume that our Ashen Wolves will suffice to carry out this ritual. So, Elfric's aim must be to carry out the Rite of Rising at the expense of the students. Lady Rhea, what precisely is the purpose of this ritual? We've heard it has the power to resurrect life, but that can't be true, can it? The Chalice is a holy artifact created by the goddess herself. It serves to restore a physical form that was previously lost to this world. So those wild tales are true. It really can bring someone back to life. Not exactly. It can breathe life into a body, but it cannot return a spirit that has already departed. Ultimately, it is a tool to return the goddess to her physical form. Her spirit is omnipresent, but her flesh is no more. Such incredible power is truly awe-inspiring and extremely dangerous. In that way, it is akin to the hero's relics. For this reason, the four apostles were never intended to pass down their crests. This gathering should never have been possible. The Ashen Wolves are now gathered together making it possible once more. And Elfric is at the center of this mess, luring them all to Abyss for his own selfish reasons. Without so much as a whisper of it to the church, of course. This incident is my own doing. I never should have entrusted the chalice to them. Lady Rhea, do you have any idea where they could have gone? I do, indeed. Garrick Mark, which is protected by the goddess, is the only place the Rite of Rising can be performed. Holding such a ritual requires absolute focus. So I imagine the setting would need to be serene, peaceful. There are countless such places within the monastery walls. Uh, the, the Holy Mausoleum? It's certainly peaceful there, but due to last month's incident, it's heavily guarded at present. For now, let us return to the monastery. There is much to consider. Oh, okay. I was. I, she said last month that my brain was trying to like. It was trying to rev up what's happening, and it's like, oh, 
this game takes place, this DLC takes place a month after you get the Sword of the Creator. All right. Lady Rhea. You look troubled, Eloise. What has happened? Thieves have breached Karagmok's village walls. They've been pillaging the shops and residences, taking whatever they please. I wonder if this has anything to do with Elfric. There's no telling. But for now, their numbers are too great. They need the knights. By your will, Lady Rhea. Allow us to clear the village of these hooligans. Yes, always. Please ensure the safety of the villagers immediately. However, leave a few of your best knights here with me. Yes, your grace. I'll see to it. Teach? You look like you've got something to say. I do. It's about Yuri. He told you to meet up with him at the Holy Mausoleum? You never run out of secrets, do you, Teach? I'm certain that Yuri had his reasons for setting up this meeting. He took the time to speak with you, however cryptically, before he left. Fair point, Dimitri. I do wonder why he told you it needed to be after midnight. Wouldn't it be better to rush to their aid immediately? Yuri's no fool. There's a method to his madness. Thanks for watching. Videos like this are only possible thanks to the generous support of my supporters over on Patreon. And you can see the names of my various supporters going across the screen right now. But I did want to highlight my top tiered supporters that are in two groups. First up, we have the Wayfinders. They include Azure Counselor, Dronic LX, Haas Bear, Javier Pork Sword, <laughs> Lasky 3, Matthew Cassidy, Mitzi, Mr. I Like Bacon and the Dungeon Master. But of course, standing even above them are my top tiered supporters, the organization, the few, the proud, the three people that paid me 50 bucks a month. They include Colleen Suarez, KC, and WTF Spider-Man. Thank you so much to all of my supporters, big and small. If you would like to contribute and make sure these videos can continue to happen, you can do so over at patreon.com slash kzexcellent. Every little bit counts and is appreciated. And with that being said, I will see you guys next time.